Welcome back. We're here at Mascoma Savings Bank, and joining me now is a local artist many of you will recognize, both in name and face, Margaret Dwyer. Thanks for joining us. Hi, Lynn. Thanks for having me. We're surrounded by the splendorous beauty. It's just gorgeous. You've Thank obviously you. been busy. Um, you paint so many different styles, but today we're going to talk about portraiture. What led you on that journey? Um, I do bounce around a lot with different subject matter. Um, some of you might know my landscape with figures of some local scenes that I've done of King Ridge and uh, Sunday afternoon of the skaters in front of New London. And those uh, figures in the landscapes have always um, connected to people, I think. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they see themselves in there mm -hmm. or someone they knew. Um, I always love the landscape. I, it's a touchstone for me in my painting. I revisit it even after I do a series of abstract or something else and I fell in love with actually doing the figure when I was an art student way back when I won't say when <laughs> and um, after living here for 25 years I just really feel that injecting some of my own personal life into the landscapes is the the sort of organic thing that I need to do that I'm inspired to do I didn't do portraits for a long time. I'm not a real fan of uh, traditional formal portraiture. Mm -hmm. I'm talking more about candid and capturing a moment um, as opposed to just a face. Right. So for instance, um, uh, this is a series I've done that I've started in the last couple weeks. I was really inspired after um, watching my grandson for the morning and dolling him up in a rabbit suit, which he'll <laughs> probably not forgive me for yeah. someday. But And then I walked him over to the alpaca farm where his mom works and where Ira goes all the time. He's very familiar with it. And I followed him around with my camera and was really inspired by the interactions and just watching him grow. And I wanted to capture that not only for me, but for everybody, I think. Um, a good figure in a landscape speaks to anybody, whether it's your relative in there or not. Mm -hmm. um, so I, this has inspired me to begin a book. Um, oh, nice. Which I think will be really fun to do. Uh, the Alpaca Farm is in Elkins. There's a lot of great imagery of Kearsarge and mm -hmm. such. So that's on the horizon. Super. Um, I've also done some portraits of the face. This is one that I've done of my daughter. It's very small, mm -hmm. um, but I thought it captured just a sort of gentle quality. My son, uh, handsome guy that he is. He's a musician. Yep. Jake Davis and the Whiskey Stones. Jake Davis and the Whiskey Stones. Free plug. <laughs> Look at that. Um, he wow. broke his ankle uh -huh. just before he played a New Year's Eve concert. And so he had to perform with crutches. Mm -hmm. And we went down, and this is him before the gig. And I've, I've captured his face and his likeness, but what I think I've captured more is the memory of the evening. The moment. Mm -hmm. um, so it's, it's a really cool way to preserve your life and the lives of those that you really care about. And it, you know, it doesn't even have to be the figure itself. Sometimes um, the figure is present without it being there. Um, this is a painting, I, a print of a painting that I did a long time ago, mm -hmm. my son's bike, which he had outgrown that year. So for me, I sort of caught a little piece of his childhood in this. Um, you don't need to know that it's Jake's bike. Yeah. But for me, that, there's a story behind it. So yeah. I'm, I'm working with some so illustrative ideas mm -hmm. and lots of different things, yes. Mm -hmm. I'm just thinking that it's um, a great gift. I mean, that just to me, to capture your child or your husband or your sister in a place that's important to them would really be lovely. I've just done some interesting commission work for some local people. Um, one of them captured the three kids on the beach in California. Mm -hmm. It's not a local scene, but the husband is from California. So to him, that's a scene of home. Yeah. And it was a beautiful kids on the rocks with the blue ocean, which is not definitely not the Atlantic. Um, and another one, I just captured a farm girl running with a pail mm -hmm. and the landscape. 
a boy with a Superman lunchbox the first day of school. I mean, yes. there's there's just tons of great stories yeah. out there. It adds some nice, nice depth, and I think you just yeah. hit it. It tells the story it as does. opposed to just being a face. Well, we've got your contact information up on the screen. Um, people are welcome to contact you, take a look at some more of your work, um, and we are really blessed to have you in our area. You're really a terrific artist, so thanks for sharing with us thanks today. Thanks so much. Take care.